Hello there, this is Amanda Wilkinson. I'm here to do another reading for you tonight. Good evening. It is Sunday, June the 27th, 2021. Welcome to my channel. If you're watching me on Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube, thanks for watching. If you could like, share, and subscribe, that would help me out a lot. And thank you. Those people who are watching me again, I really appreciate your continued support. Thank you, thank you. I am using the Lightseer's Tarot and Moonology Oracle Cards by Yasmin Boland. How's everybody this evening? I hope you're doing well. You deserve love. Please take care of yourself. Take care of the people you care about. This is a general reading. It will not resonate for everyone. Take what does and leave the rest. And there's no gender in tarot. We'll try not to say he or she, but sometimes I forget. So know, just know that it's interchangeable. Let's cut the deck. Spirit. First card out. The Ace of Pentacles. The Ace of Pentacles. New money. A new money offer. Yes. Love it. Uh, in this picture, it looks like there is roots coming from the coin. Because it is Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. New money. New job. A raise. Um, side job. New money. Love it. What is crossing this? The star. This is the star I always talk about. This is the star inside you. You see? It's it's like she's got a... Um, holding a, a balloon. And here up here is her star. But the star is really inside her chest. This is Aquarius energy. This is an angel card. This is a wish card. This is your positive spirit. It is consciously known. The Seven of Cups. Seven of Cups, water energy. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. There is all these cups. This is the fantasy card. This means you have a lot of options. This can be love. Um, this can be jobs. You, you have a lot of options that you have to choose from. What is unconsciously known? The Two of Pentacles. The Two of Pentacles is back and forth um, energy. This she this person is kind of wishy-washy and they cannot make a decision. I am a th this is uh, Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but this energy kind of reminds me of um, uh, Libras. I am a Libra and I know that I have a lot of problems making decisions, always looking at both sides. So this is indecisiveness. You have all these options, but you don't know which one to choose. Recent past, the Page of Swords, the Page of Swords. This is Air Energy, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. This is Truth, Clarity, and Communication. This person is a stalker. You have a stalker. But Amanda says... If you got a stalker, you show them something to look at. You live your best life. You look through these options. Let them look. Let them watch you. Near future. The Three of Pentacles. This is uh, 
Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Three of Pentacles talks about working with people to build a firm foundation. This could be um, a relationship. This could be a work endeavor where you're working um, with other people in your company. We had the Ace of Pentacles already, new, new uh, money offer. And this is talking about working and making your money grow. I like it. Where do you find yourself? The High Priestess. Hmm. So this person is intuitive. They know how to figure people out. They're empathic. See, there's a moon on her, but just above her head. And um, the High Priestess is very intuitive. I like her energy. External influences. The lovers. The lovers. This is Gemini energy. The lovers. Um, kind of self-explanatory, right? We've got the the couple here, and they're in love. Hopes and or fears. The Queen of Wands. The Queen of Passion. Queen of Passion. You can see her. She has candles all over here. She's got a cat. Queen of Passion. Fire Energy. Aries Leo Sagittarius. She is good looking, or he... Good looking, charismatic, fun to be with, sensual, sexual. She has a wand in her hand. So she is the queen of passion. Overall outcome, death and rebirth. Scorpio energy. This is the end of a cycle and the beginning of a new beautiful cycle. It's see kind of like the, the cloak of death, but... There's that star again. There's that star again. And this is rebirth. Trees growing again. So out of the ashes comes something new and beautiful. I like the death card because of the rebirth. Rebirth into something better. The Ten of Swords. This is air energy. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. This is being stabbed in the back, being betrayed. But this is the Ten of Swords, which means the worst is over. And you will be starting a new journey, a new better journey. Three of Wands. Fire Energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Uh, she's got a surfboard here. She's ready to go surfing. Um, but she's like waiting. In this, uh, in this deck, I would say she's like waiting for a good wave. But in your life, you're waiting for something. Waiting for something to come. Eight of Wands. Oh, there we go. Passionate new communication. This is fire energy as well. Aries Leo Sagittarius. So, passionate new communication. Could be texts. Could be talking to someone online. Oh, oh, the lovers, two of cups, water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, this is the lovers, this is the lovers, you are the lovers, so whatever, whatever cup you chose, looks like you found your love. And judgment, karma. Looks like she's got a um, conjuring a Patronus up here. Judgment. Well, it looks like karma's in your favor. I like it all. Don't let the death cards. Don't let the death card scare you. Meditate and contemplate. New moon in Pisces. Meditate and contemplate. Yeah, figure things out. 
Didn't we have the two of pentacles here? Yeah. Meditate and com contemplate. This is kind of like um, a little bit of hermit mode. Like take a minute and uh, try make a, a decision. Balance, spirituality, and practicality. Full moon in Pisces. We got a full moon in Pisces, new moon in Pisces. You guys had this yesterday. Balance, spirituality, and practicality. Or the day before. Bottom of the deck. It is time to take action. New moon in Aries. Okay, well, I guess I'll call this... Death and re rebirth, the beginning of a new cycle. So yeah, if the star is coming, and where else did we see the, sc the star? I know we saw a star somewhere. But... Yeah, the star, uh, it's beautiful energy, beautiful energy. Oh, this is good. This is good. I like it. Beautiful. I will talk to you later. Enjoy the new journey. This is Amanda Wilkinson. Bye. Bye.